Hey there, Ruby. How's it going? I'm good, thanks. How are you? Yeah, very well. Alrighty, so we're going to do some physics tutoring today. How do you find physics usually? Um, it can get a bit difficult, but um, I enjoy it. Oh, that's great to hear. Our next topic that we're on to is understanding everything about motion. So motion in a straight line, all the Newton's laws of motion, um, and applying that. We'll begin. We'll begin in one dimension and then go from there. Um, how does that sound? Perfect. Awesome. I'll set that as a go our goal. All right. Let's solve this. A model train travels 186 centimetres to the right and then 215 centimetres to the left. Where does the train end up relative to its starting point? So, you just do 186 minus or plus 215? Yeah, so are we going to minus it or are we going to plus it? Minus? Yeah, we're going to minus it. How come? Because if he's moving to the right from the origin, mm -hmm. he then turns to the left. Yeah. Yeah, because he's moving backwards. Yeah. So we've gone 186 centimeters to the right from the origin, imagining if this is the origin. Um, and we've start, we've started here and then traveled 215 centimeters back in the opposite direction along this one dimensional imaginary line. Um, and so when we add those together, what would our final vector be from the origin? So if this is the origin here. 529. Perfect. Yeah. 29 centimeters. And so if we were to just write that as our answer, we would say minus 29. Yes. And why is it minus? Because it's past the origin. Yeah, and it's in the left direction. And what we're denoting here is that anything to the right of the origin is positive. Anything to the left of the origin is negative. And yeah, so we're in, we're in one dimension, and so we're just saying negative 29 centimeters. So we'd say 29 centimeters to the left. Good yeah. job, Ruby. That's awesome. All right, Ruby, that brings us to the end of the physics session. How are you feeling now about motion in a straight line in general? Much more confident. I understood it all very well. Excellent. Yeah, you did very, very well in um, yeah, picking up and understanding all that content. So yeah, I think we did achieve our learning goal today and we'll just keep continuing our physics journey in all our future physics sessions. Yep, sounds good. All right, thanks so much, Ruby. Thank you. All right, see you later. Bye. Bye.